Welcome student. Today let's see how to multiply and divide fractions. First of all let's see how to multiply fractions. For this let's learn about the multiplication rule. According to the multiplication rule the product of two fractions is also a fraction whose numerator is simply the multiplication of numerators of two fractions and denominator is simply the multiplication of denominators of two fractions. For example we have a fraction a over b and now we multiply this by c over d. Simply multiply the numerators of these two fractions that is a and c as well as the denominators of two fractions that is b and d. So a times c will simply give ac while b times d will give bd. So our new fraction will be ac over bd. So this was multiplication rule. Now let's learn this multiplication rule with the help of an example. Here we need to multiply 1 by 4 and 2 by 5. Simply multiply the numerators to get the new numerator. So 1 times 2 will simply give 2, which is our new numerator. Now multiply the denominators to get the new denominator. So 4 times 5 will give 20, which is our new denominator. So the new fraction is simply 2 over 20. Now we can simply reduce this 2 over 20. Divide both numerators and denominator by 2. We get 1 over 10. So that means 1 over 4 times 2 over 5 gives 2 over 20 which when reduced give 1 over 10. Now let's learn how to divide the fractions. Similarly, let's learn about division rule. Divide by fraction is same as multiplying by its reciprocal. For example, I have two fractions A over B and C over D. And I divide these two fractions. So A over B divided by C over D can also be written as a over B whole divided by C over D. Now we can write down the denominator that is C over D in a reciprocal form and change the division sign to multiplication. So this can be written as A over B times D over C. Now simply multiply these two fractions. So A times D gives AD while B times C gives BC. So our answer will be AD over BC. Now let's understand this with the help of an example. We need to divide 1 over 4 by 2 over 5. Simply apply the division rule. And we can write on this as 1 over 4 whole divided by 2 over 5. Now simply invert the denominator fraction, that is 2 over 5, and multiply the two fractions. So this can be written as 1 over 4 times with 5 over 2. Multiply the two numerators together. So 1 times 5 gives 5, which is the new numerator simply multiply the denominators of the fractions. So 4 times 2 gives 8, which is the new denominator. So now new fraction is simply 5 over 8. Check if you can reduce this further. 5 over 8 cannot be reduced further. So our answer will be simply 5 over 8. Now let's revise this quickly again with the help of an example. We need to divide 2 by 3 with 
1 over 4. Simply first of all change this division sign to multiplication sign and invert this second fraction. So now 1 over 4 can be written as 4 over 1. Now multiply two numerators together. 2 times 4 gives 8 and multiply two denominators together. 3 times 1 gives 3. So the final answer will be 8 over 3. Check if you can reduce this further. This can't be reduced further so the answer is 8 over 3. With this we come to the end of this topic. Goodbye and see you in the next session.